Hello everyone, let us see a problem related to diffusion, but it also contains the good concept of error function. So let us see. A solar cell is fabricated by diffusing phosphorus. Okay, that is the end of it because phosphorus has five vacancy, five valence electron, right? Five valence electron, and silicon it is four valent valence electron material. And since it is five, so there is one extra atom. It goes right from a constant surface source of ten to power twenty atoms per cm cube. So this is the surface concentration into a p-type silicon wafer. So we are putting phosphorus in a p-type silicon wafer containing Cb. That means how we have made this p-type by adding some boron. That has the concentration 10 to the power 16 boron per atom per cm cube. The diffusivity of phosphorus is 1.2 into 10 to the power minus 14 cm square per second, and the diffusion time is 15 minutes at 1000 degree centigrade. How far from the surface is the junction depth? That is, and the junction is called as where we have this Cb is equal to Cp, means concentration of boron atom will be equal to concentration of phosphorus atom and given ERFC okay ERFC x equal to 10 power minus 4 at x equal to 2.73 right so guys here it is given ERFC so what is this ERFC we have heard like ERF that is error function but what is this ERFC so that is new thing which I will talk about to you so basically this ERFC is called as complementary error function. Okay. We know that in the case of error function, what are the values it can have? The graph looks something like this. This is minus 1, this is plus 1, and it goes about to infinity and minus infinity. Right. So the maximum value of error function can be plus one and the minimum value it can be minus one. Okay. So when we have error function of something called x and suppose we subtract it with one. Okay. So if I subtract it to one, then this is called as error function complementary x. So this is nothing but the just the complementary function of error function. So that is called ERFC. So you just take care. Suppose in the question, if they gave you ERFC, that means you understand that it is basically given 1 minus ERFX, right? Okay. So see, uh, we take the sketch like a silicon wafer. So at this surface, so we write it as Cl, Cs equal to 10 to the power 20, right? Atoms per cm cube. Then at some distance x, the diffusion of this phosphorus will happen. And at this x, what should be the concentration of phosphorus? It should be the concentration which is equal to the concentration of boron. So here that is C at x equal to 10 power 16, right? Atoms per cm cube. Okay, fine. And what is the initial concentration of phosphorus in this material? So that we write it as C naught and it is 0, right? Because there is no initially phosphorus is present. D we know it is given 1.2 into 10 power minus 14 cm square per second t is how much 15 minutes so it will be 15 into 60 second the standard unit and we are not converting this cm square per second into standard because the concentration is also given in some thing called as per cm cube so that will be taken care now we know the formula that is cx minus c naught by Cs minus C naught equal to 1 minus error function 
x by 2 root over dt so see guys so here only i have written this 1 minus d so can we write it as error function complementary x by 2 root over dt yes right so cx is how much 10 power 16 minus 0 and cs is 10 to power 20 minus 0 equal to erf x by 2 root over dt so this will be how much 10 to power 4 right so this implies error function x by 2 root over dt is equal to 10 power minus 4 right and this is what here it is given at error function complementary of some value x if you assume so here x will be this complete term x by 2 root t right equal to 10 power 4 then x equal to 2.73 that means x by 2 root under dt will be equal to 2.73 so you can find this x how so just multiply d so d equal to 1.2 into 10 power minus 14 into time 15 into 60 right so you do it by calculator so i am also doing 2.73 into 2 into root over 1.2 into 10 power minus 14 into 15 into 60 so this is 1.794 into 10 power minus 5 and this will be in unit of what cm right because 1.2 into 10 power minus 14 uh, this is the definition it is in cm square per second and the time it was in second so cm square so if you take root of cm square it will be cm okay so this is what it was required right So this is what it was required here x value so this we have got okay so hopeful suppose this type of question where erfc is written so you can just take care of this so there was nothing very special about this question but only concept was something very beautiful which i found so that's why i try to share with you so thank you everyone